King Street. Crowded as usual on a Sunday afternoon, but early Sunday morning, crowds were left shaken as gunfire erupted. Around 12.55 a.m. this morning, um, officers were in the area of King and Morris streets. Um, they heard a, a number of gunshots ring out um, and saw uh, folks running kind of in all different directions. Charleston Police Sergeant Elizabeth Wolfson says officers responded quickly. They ran toward the incident. Um, they located a number of individuals that had been injured. Police say that number is five. They applied emergency trauma aid to um, some of the victims here, and all those folks have been treated um, at area hospitals for non-life-threatening gunshot wounds. Wolfson says officers also detained several people seen running from the area. Two of whom were arrested for unlawfully carrying firearms. 20-year-old Tavon Davis was one of those arrested, and the other a 16-year-old juvenile. Investigators are still working to determine if those two people were directly involved in the shooting. Police say the investigation is still ongoing and they're working to gather more information. Detectives and investigators have been canvassing that entire area in an effort to get um, any video footage that's possible either from businesses um, or individuals who may have been there. Mayor John Tecklenburg also responding to the violence with a statement. It says in part, quote, enough is enough. The senseless violence has to stop. The mayor went on to say, we can and will continue to fight these problems here in Charleston. The mayor ended his statement by saying, public safety is the first and most important job of government. And regardless of party or ideology, we must all work together to stop the violence, keep our city and citizens safe.